this recording. Action, here we are on Saturday, May 29th. It's about 2.30 in the afternoon, and I'm here with my friend Inder. He's also come from Detroit, and he's gonna be playing the dole today. The dole is traditional Indian drum, which is what we use for the barat. Now, the barat is like the groom's uh, processional. So basically, the groom will come on a horse, he'll mount the horse, everybody will dance around him, you know, to the beats, of course, and it'll be a very joyous occasion. And then the bride's mother will meet the groom at the entrance to the altar to have a few ceremonies. So, in there, uh, if you could just briefly explain kind of like, you know, what the dole or, or um, you know, how long you've been doing this for and do you play different instruments and stuff? Yeah, the dole is uh, just a North Indian drum instrument. It was first a war drum um, back, you know, a couple thousand years ago. Um, now it's just, I mean, it's more for joyous occasions, occasions now. Um, I've been playing dole probably for uh, four or five, five years now uh, with DJ Naveen here. Um, you know, he's got me a, uh, a lot of, uh, played at a lot of brats, a lot of receptions, um, you know, even different functions uh, like parties, birthday parties, stuff like that. Um, so it's a great opportunity, you know, for me to kind of keep playing and just keep enjoying what I do. And of course we go all, all over. We are in, uh, uh, outside of Cleveland today, and there's from Detroit, so he does a lot of events in Detroit. And is there any, with regards to the dole um, and like the decorations, or any special decorations you put on, or it's just stuff that that's unique to you, or? Um, well, these actually custom made myself. You know, I I, I got the um, all the yarn myself and just uh, decorated myself, just because um, you know, just to, again, it's a joyous occasion, so why not you know fancy it up a little bit and make it more colorful and just happy. So. Okay. Yep. Well, before we get started with the broth, let's get like a little 10 second uh, teaser if we can. Uh, and there's just gonna warm up a little bit. We'll get a 10 or 15 second little. Uh, is that okay? Yeah. Are you do? Okay. You ready? Yeah. Let's let's have Matt film that. Get a little teaser for us. All right. So thank you, Inder, and Matt's here also. Thank you, Matt. So again, this is DJ Naveen. Uh, it's about 2:30. We're gonna start the barath, and then we will continue on with the wedding. Action. And here we are. About to start the barath.
Center on Saturday, May 29th, 2010. It's about 7, 10 p.m. We're here at Landerhaven Hall in Beechwood, Ohio, and we're completely set up for the reception now. And we're actually doing video mixing this evening. So Brian, if you want to pan the camera, and you can see we have two screens, one on each side. We will be doing the video mixing. This is something that we do offer. And if you're interested in getting it, please contact us and we'll tell you more about it. We have Indian music videos, Bollywood, Bhangra, as well as hip hop and top 40 videos, all the way from the 60s to the current songs. So just you can see what they did for the room. They kept pretty much the same layout as for the wedding. We have two K-10s on each side with the Shrimp King with the Slim Par 56 running on a slow fade to change the colors. And what they did for the head table was they kept the pillars there and they just put a sweetheart table for the bride and groom. And let me show you the Yorkville subwoofers that we have. These are the two Yorkvilles. Now, Brian, who's with me here, can you please give some specs about the Yorkville subwoofers? Yeah, they're... Um, Why do you prefer them? I bought them back in 2004. I needed some really powerful subwoofers. Um, they were the best ones that I could afford at the time, and ironically, they're, they've been some really powerful subs for me. I've used them at events up to 1,000 people. Um, I recommend them to anyone. And to be able to test, they throw out massive amounts of bass. Yes, he knows me as the bass king because I'm crazy for bait. Now let's show you our setup over here. As you can see we have the video going. This is one of Shah Rukh Khan's music videos. So let me turn it down here. I'm using Virtual DJ. We're using the video mixing program. And let me move this over here and show you what we got over here. What we got over here is the DBX driver act. The PX or PA? PX. This is the PX for powered speakers. Now can you explain what the driver act is and how it helps? the overall show. Well, uh, most DJs can uh, appreciate carrying a lighter load. What this has on it is your crossover, your EQ, it's got a subharmonics, and it's got a lot of built-in programs for most, for the most popular DJ speakers out there. Everything from JBL to Yorkville, EAW settings. Um, it just makes your life a lot easier. You can throw a mic out in the middle of the room like we did earlier and it automatically EQs. Um, and then it has automatic microphone feedback suppression so you will never get that uh, you know, unwanted uh, loud chirping when someone talks on the mic wrong. So I recommend it to anyone. It's and it little, cost about how much? It's about 350 bucks. Uh, it's plug and play, it's pretty easy? It is, it's a little bit of a learning curve, but um, most DJs could figure it out in a few days. Okay. Great. Well, we'll get you on the next clip. And Matt is here, and he brought some yummy snacks for us. So thank you, Matt. And we're all ready to uh, rock the reception in just a few moments.